very cool experience. We're at the Zocalo of Toluca right now and we just experienced the raising of the flag. It is 8 o'clock in the morning. It's pretty awesome. Let's continue exploring Toluca. Welcome to Toluca. Behind me is one of the oldest churches here in the state. So a little bit about the state of Toluca. It was founded in 1530. It's uh, 80 kilometers, which is about 60 miles west of Mexico City and is the gateway to Nevado de Toluca National Park. The crater, which I could not visit due to COVID in my last video, which you can check out over here. Now, this is the, temp uh, the Cathedral of Toluca, also found around the same time when the uh, city was founded. Join me on today's adventures and I hope you guys are loving the views already. Another beautiful church within the vicinity of the Zocolo, the center of Toluca, Iglesia del Carmen. Shall we have a look inside? Bon Appetit Street Tacos, $1. The most important thing when you're here in Mexico, Coca-Cola made out of real sugar. Cheers. From a little taco stand like this, my taco and the Coke only cost a dollar and fifty. Now we're heading behind me is the, the botanical garden, so we'll be going in there. Any the entrance? Only 25 pesos, which is a dollar and twenty-five cents. Let's go. It was used in, as a market, as a public market, here until 1975 until it was converted. And you can see the many, many beautiful, colorful stained glass windows. There's over half a million pieces and they've been brought from all over the world. Now we're going to go check out some of the plants that they're a feature from also from all over the world. And it's very exciting when you're here in Toluca. Let's go! What a beautiful place. If there's one thing you guys, even if you don't like looking at flowers, the smells in there are beautiful. Even through my mask that I was required to wear inside, I could definitely feel the uh, pine cones and all the flowers. It was just beautiful. Behind me, you can see the Los Portales, which is the longest set of arches in Mexico. It's a, a stretch of arches here along this beautiful building. They're lined up with shops where you can buy plenty of things such as clothes, food, candy shop and actually the candy shop that you see behind me right there I'm actually gonna go buy some candy and I got myself a well I'll show you guys what it looks like first up we have the dulce de salmon which is a condensed milk with guava flavoring let's take a try really good and this was only eight pesos this candy is an actual lime shell filled with coconut and it is really good at Los Portales So 
behind me is another beautiful church called Alfredores. Unfortunately, it is still closed right now because of COVID, so they have uh, shorter amounts of time that the churches are open. Before I leave this place, I wanted to come here and show you guys what it looks like from the top. And you guys can see the cathedral and the mountain in the back. That's actually Volcano Nevado de Toluca, which I was attempting to climb yesterday. However, it was close due to COVID. But nonetheless, it turned out to be a fantastic day. Don't ever let one thing ruin your day. There's many other possibilities to make it one a better day. We have now entered the neighborhood, which is considered a little bit unsafe. But so far, the people have been seem very nice. Everybody says, good morning, good day. But you may be wondering, why are these buildings all so colorful? Well, the thing is, it gives bad neighborhoods a good image, kind of to get away from the slum slash poor people. And it kind of gives it like its own persona, so to speak. We're clearly taking a little detour as we're not sure exactly the way to get to the top. You guys can see the Toluca Cathedral all the way in the back. That's where the Zocalo, that's where the center is. And over here we have the colorful village. And just in the background you have the beautiful Nevado de Toluca volcano. If you come to Toluca or you're driving through, you must come here. It's a little bit hard to find, but you just... We just found it really by mistake by just driving around. We don't know what, exactly what this place is called, but the indication is this is your final destination that you want to look for, is the cross. It's been a beautiful view of the city, but it's time to hit the road again. And we're at the end of our tour in Toluca. We're here in Zocalo saying goodbye. Thank you for visiting me with me this wonderful town and see you guys from the next place. Ciao!